Welcome to the Toxic Relationship Recovery Program. Are you recovering from a relationship with a borderline narcissist or social psychopath? And are you tired of feeling depressed or down or getting sucked back into the toxic dynamic that leaves you devastated and confused each and every time? Then this is for you. Dating somebody with borderline personality disorder, narcissism or social psychopath can be a traumatizing experience. I know because I've been there myself and I've helped hundreds of people recover and find safety, confidence and happiness again. So you're not alone. Here are some of the things you might have experienced. First, they idolized you and made you feel incredible. It's like a spotlight was shining just on you. They showered you with so much interest. They appreciated everything about you. They liked and wanted the same things as you, or so it appeared. It felt like you found your soulmate, even if you didn't believe in a soulmate before. You know, they told you how special you are, appreciated everything about you and how much they love you. It was very intense, very fast. They put you on a pedestal and told you you're the most amazing person ever and they want to spend their life with you. It's called love bombing, mirroring and future projection. The idolization stage that likely came to an end. Either when the image of you being perfect ended or they believed you might abandon them or they simply felt no use for you anymore. Once that happened, you experience a sudden shift where they go into a rage, give you the silent treatment or withdraw affection altogether. You likely felt lost, confused and started to feel anxious trying to win back their affection. That's the beginning of intermittent reinforcement where they pulled you in and pushed you away with inconsistent rewards and punishment causing an addiction and a trauma bond to form. That's why you obsess about them and find it so hard to let go. You know, it jumped from one extreme of you being the love of their life to sudden being abused and discarded so coldly and fast or disregarded. It's called splitting, unstable emotion and lack of object constancy. And for the narcissist assistant social psychopath, it was often just a facade to get what they wanted from you. You are left in shock, confusion and despair, hoping this person you believe to be real will somehow come back. You know, they likely lined up a replacement and replace you instantly just to add to the pain, leaving you confused and thinking, did it all mean nothing? What happened? What could I have done differently? You know, how could, how could they do that to me? I will answer all these questions in the program. And you struggle to make sense of anything that happened. You feel devastated and in pain and suddenly who you thought was the love of your life was gone, betrayed you, abandoned you and deceived you. They might have pulled you back in and pushed you away repeatedly while replacing you with a new person until they discarded you completely. You would doubt your reality as they may use something called gaslighting that makes you think there must be something wrong with you. It's like a vampire sucking the blood out of you until you feel lifeless. You slowly go weak and don't realize that you're dying. It's like being caught in a horror film and you are the actor getting killed at the end. It's one of the most painful and traumatizing experiences that we can have as a human being. While they seem to have moved on instantly, you are left devastated, confused and struggling to trust others and your own perception of judgment. That makes the world feel very unsafe. You are left in a state of shock and denial. You can't stop thinking about them and hope that they will come back. It's not love. It's an addiction and a trauma bond. You might reach out to friends and family for support, but their attempt to help just make you feel worse. You feel misunderstood and alone. Does that all sound familiar? I know right now you probably just want the pain to go away. You want to understand what actually happened. You want to trust again. You want to feel safe again. You want to feel wanted and loved again. You want the obsessive addiction to go away so you don't miss them so much. The pain is created by the shock, addiction, abandonment, betrayal and what your mind make all these things mean about you. I will show you how to break the obsessive addiction and trauma bond that makes you miss them so much and how your stories enhance the pain that you're experiencing. I will guide you through the process of turning your pain and despair and confusion into joy, confidence and safety. I will help you understand what happened so the world can feel like a safe place again. I'll help you make sense of their behavior so your doubts and questions get resolved. I will teach you how to trust your own judgment again and sharpen your ability to spot warning signs and manipulation so you never fall victim to a predator like this again. I will teach you how to feel safe again by seeing these dynamics and building trust in your own ability to prioritize your needs and set healthy boundaries. 
I will teach you what real love is so you don't feel attached to quick and intensity anymore and instead get a sense of self-love and worth that makes love bombing really unappealing to you. I will show you how to heal old wounds and make you receptible or made you receptible and a target for these predators. Let's end your pain and confusion and heal your wounds so you can feel safe, confident and find your joy again, just like I did and my clients do. You can do it too. Sign up below and start your healing now. It's really zero risk as I have a seven day money back guarantee. So if you don't like it, just let me know and you'll get your money back, no questions asked. I want to help you. And if you don't think it's for you, then I don't want your money. If you implement what I teach you, I'm confident that you would heal and flourish as my customers have done and I have done. That's why I offer this money back guarantee. I really hope to see you on the other side.